So I started this um, YouTube channel because I wanted to be able to like vlog about me and my life and my travels and all these little random things that happen in my life and and just hope that someone would be interested and maybe even make some friends along the way and you know that sort of thing. Um, I was super motivated for 2023. I didn't have any particular um, you know plans in mind or anything that I really was looking to like accomplish or anything like that. I just was hoping to have a good time and to post about it and I don't know and share it with you all but this year hasn't gone quite so well it's just it's just not working out first of all I didn't have a whole lot to even post about I wasn't doing anything I was going to work every day I was coming home and that was just kind of it and boring right so what I decided to do was just not put that pressure on myself to post if nothing was happening and just wait until, you know, not worry about analytics and numbers and all that and just post if I had something to say or something to post. Well, then last month, February 22nd, um, one of my three brothers passed away. He was younger than me. And this has really knocked me down, like more than I could ever tell you about. And I don't want, you know, to just make this a complete downer of a video, but honestly, you know, they say, I'm a, I'm a Christian, I believe in God, and they say that God doesn't put anything any more on you than you can bear. Well, and sometimes if that's true, then I think to myself, then why do I have to be such a strong person? Because sure, there is so much put on me that God must think I am a superhero, <laughs> honestly. Because every time I start to get a little bit happy about something, a little motivated or something good happens, I lift myself up and I keep on going, something else comes along, knocks me down, back into another shit show of misery. <laughs> like I sometimes and I know people's lives are a lot a lot of people have a lot worse situations than me, but um you know I gosh I could tell you guys some stories and I try not to um post about that kind of stuff because nobody wants to hear that, right? Nobody wants to hear about all the misery going on in someone's life. But fact is, I just, the curveballs and the hits just keep coming. And I am mentally exhausted. You know, I, I just don't, like I lost my mom in July, 2021. And I remember saying to my brother, because he was not the healthiest person, I said, I said, I don't want to be doing this again anytime soon. So he needed to get it together in the health department. He needed to start losing weight. He needed to take care of himself, eating better and all that, you know. And uh, here we are, a year and, gosh, not even a year and a half later, and he's gone. And... I don't know. I've I'm really struggling to get back motivated. Like I I've been going to work. I've been coming home, you know, and but outside of the have tos in life, it's like I just haven't been motivated to pick up the camera. I haven't been motivated to I don't know, plan a trip or do anything. I just I just feel like I mean, it hasn't been that long. It hasn't even been a month yet, but I'm just, I'm miserable. And I know there's a lot of people out there who can relate to this, you know, like, when you're miserable, you're just miserable. <laughs> and sometimes you just have to go through it. But I don't know, some somehow I feel like this time's different. It was just like, 
one horrible loss on top of another horrible loss just as I was, you know, getting back on my feet and stuff. And I just, ugh. I don't know how to, to, to keep going. Oh, you know what? I forgot my TV is on over there. Hold on. I'll be right back. So anyway, I'm back. I'm such a dodo bird. I had that TV on so loud. I, I, but you know what? In all this misery, I have become a complete space cadet as well. I have just, I'm so out of focus. I'm so off kilter. My mind is everywhere, every which. I just like, I, I'm late for everything. I can't seem to... What I need to do, I need to really get back into my regular routine of working out and running and stuff like that. And I'm going to, I am going to, starting tomorrow, this Sunday, start of the week. Just shh. But um, that always helps. Running helps me a lot. Um, but like I said, I have a very small circle of friends and family so and and really we're all kind of going through it right now but anyway i just wanted to kind of get on here and explain my absence and lack of posting and and just uh i don't know if you guys have any i guess we all just have to process that you know that kind of loss in our own ways and stuff but i don't know i'm really struggling to get back up and I don't know I guess anything you guys can offer me um I know you know probably months from now I'll just be like okay okay getting my bearing back and you know but you never get back your loved ones so it'll, it'll never be the same so so I don't know you know, as you start getting older, like me, and you start thinking about your mortality more, and, you know, it's just, this whole life just seems like one big contest, and it's like, you know, I don't want to play the, co be in the contest anymore, I don't want to play the game anymore, I just, it, you, you know, you guys win, whoever, whoever wants to win can win, just let me be happy, I just want to be happy, shoot. I don't, I don't need to be tested anymore. And I know, like, it just seems like this life is one big test. Well, shoot. <laughs> I don't, you know, shoot, fail me then. Because I've done the best I can do. I've done the best I know how to do. And, you know, if it's not good enough to make it into heaven, well, I'm tired, shoot. <laughs> I can't, I can't keep. I don't know. Like, how do you get to the happiness and just a consistent happiness? I know life, life isn't like that, but I, you know, you know, it's like sometimes you just see some people and you're just like, wow, they're so blessed. And you don't ever see bad things happen to them and they don't seem to go through the same things. And it's just been, you know, my entire life from the time I came out of the womb, shoot, it was just like, I was on the wrong side of winning, black, female, at least I was in America where I stood a chance, you know, right? But at least I had that going for me. So I could have been born somewhere else. I could have born it, been born in a third world country where, where, you know, it was just like, oh, geez, you know, even, even harder battle, but, but I don't know. I've accomplished a lot in life, but there sure has been a lot of misery along the way. And, and I am just, I guess, you know, I'm just tired of the misery. I'm going to keep moving forward. I'm going to find my way back to feeling better about things and life and get my mojo back and all that and just be like, okay, okay, I was knocked down, but now I'm back up. And, but man, while you're in it, while you're going through it, and, and as many of you who know what I'm talking about, know, boy, it's hard while you're 
in the throes of it, in the, in the beginning stages of trying to lift yourself up from a, a blow, you know. Anyway, thanks for listening. Anybody has any comments or words of motivation, I'd be more than happy to hear them. Thank you so much for listening. And uh, I'll uh, try and post again sometime soon. Thank you. Bye.